Hello, my name is Aga and we are going to talk about different emotion this time. It's sad. We have lots of different feelings every day. Sometimes they feel nice, sometimes they are not nice. Feeling sad. When you are feeling sad, you feel upset. Feeling sad is not a nice feeling, but we all feel sad sometimes. It is a feeling that might make you want to cry. You might feel sad when? You have nobody to play with. You get told off. You hurt yourself. And also, I'm thinking some of you are staying home. And instead of going to school, you have to stay at home and do some work. Maybe you're missing your friend and that your friends and that can make you feel sad. Because I, I miss my students and that makes me feel sad sometimes. And you lose something special that can make you feel sad as well. You fall out with your friend. Look at the picture now. This child is feeling sad. What do you notice about his face? He's not crying, but we can still recognize he's not smiling either. So we can see that the boy is the boy is sad. It is good to know that what you are feeling. Very often we can feel our feelings in our bodies. And today we're going to find out how does it feel in our body when we are sad. You will need a long paper long paper, felt pen and somebody to help you. Do you remember last time in my previous video I showed you how to make a body map? So my job, you, you have to put down a long paper on the floor and then lie down, ask someone to draw all around your body and then go through from your head to your toes and think about how does it feel in your body when you are sad. So for example, when you are sad in your head uh, or in your chest, that chest, does it feel, does it feel light or maybe on your face? Do you feel like you want to cry? Or maybe when you are sad, hmm, does it feel like you want to hide somewhere? Or would you like to talk to somebody? Or when you are sad, sometimes we don't want to talk to anyone and it's still okay. So try lying down on the floor now. Stop the video, lying down on the floor on your long paper ask someone to draw around your body and think about how does it feel in your head, on your face, on your chest, hands, maybe with your hands you want to cover your face when you are sad and maybe your hands feel very heavy. Just think about it. How does it feel? in your belly when you are sad? Do you feel like eating something or maybe you don't have, you lose your appetite? How does it feel in your legs when you feeling sad? Good luck with that. Are you ready? We can, we can, what can we do when we are feeling sad? There are lots of things you can do when you are feeling sad. 
Feeling sad is not a nice feeling, but you can tell yourself that this feeling will go away. It won't last forever. It will go away. It always goes away. You could talk to your friend. To your friend or an adult makes you happy and calm. Also, you could have some quiet time. Some people like to talk about their problems and sometimes we need some quiet time to think about it and then have a conversation with someone we trust. You could think about happy things or something that makes you want to smile. You could use your words to say why you are sad. That's everything. I wish you good luck and see you next time. Bye bye.